hi guys today we will discuss regarding the mq6 sensor which can detect uh, like alcohol content in your sanitizer sanitizer like i have two types of sanitizer here like one is from organic alcohol based uh, like uh, hand sanitizer <laughs> and uh, i have one dettol instant hand sanitizer the basic idea is like we have to check the contents like uh, in this uh, it is written alcohol based isopropyl alcohol so there are the, these are the various contents so we how can we verify this that this is really the one we have to use in this uh, difficult times like we have some going ongoing coronavirus uh, like situations and which is being so this is a highly sold product like uh, i am talking that also we can verify this is whether this is a fake one or really it contains the uh, alcohol based as per who uh, they have recommended the double like uh, alcohol based sanitization so we will be uh, proving in house that uh, this two uh, like sanitizer are uh, which one is more effective okay okay so this is mq6 sensor it is a very cheap module and here you can see this says high sensitivity to lpg iso butane propane small sensitivity to alcohol smoke fast response so these are the various pins of the sensor here you can see it runs on 5 volt ground this is the do pin this is the analog pin so our idea is to basically connect this sensor to any Arduino pin, Arduino uh, like board, you can use also ESP board so that finally you can visualize like uh, what I have done is use I have used a thing speak uh, to use the channels and I have used API keys to enable the content of Arduino sensors directly over internet so we need not have to use any supporting like uh, monitor serial monitor we can just type on the web page here we can select the our channel and we can directly monitor the uh, readings here here i have used as gas sensor mq6 so we can directly do the demo and online no also we can check it so this is the e that mq6 sensor gas sensor we will be using this sensor for verifying the alcohol content of the sanitizer so i use this breadboard this is the humidity sensor this is the board of like uh, esp8266 board it is generally wi-fi board this is the cheap esp8266 this is other complementary board so that we need not have any external board it, it's contain everything here so as you have seen it has very simple connections so i have used d7 pin for like you said uh, humidity sensor and this is the api api means what i have done i have used the keys api keys and included in the arduino program like this is the right api keys basically what i have did is using this key and programming it through this code i have used api key so that this data of the sensor is repeatedly <coughs> dumped repeatedly dumped to things pick website so basically what i have done i have first connected the wi-fi model like uh, this model to internet like my in-house router so I have done is this in-house router you have to uh, put SSID password and this is the server where this API key is used to uh, dump data of the sensors so I have used the humidity temperature sensor and here you can see the speed I have defined it after with connected it is first initially connected to Wi-Fi because we have to view the sensor value on the internet so this is the mq6 sensor sensor voltage actually we have directly used ao pin to write the values of the sensor to esp port like uh, this is our sensor 
and this is the uh, like a open so basically what this loop does it's calculate the value and after that calculating here I have you can see uh, I have dumped it the sensor value directly to the things pick website so after executing the program we can see that it displays the values in monitor like uh, this is the sensor voltage the sensor voltage is presently 0.83 volt why because there is no alcohol uh, gas around uh, this like sensor okay so once uh, the alcohol content increases the voltage increases and we can easily find out how the value changes so basically after integration you can see the values here you can see the gas sensor value currently not active why because the voltage is very low it's based upon the ppm values it can measure the gas sensor can uh, measure values as per the ppm so here like uh, when you go to data sheet you can see this is the graph of mk6 sensor here you can see that it's most sensitive to lpg here and alcohol is between this one this curve so basically uh, what is this curve vertical it is rs by zero is the ratio and this is a ppm parts per million 10,000 parts per million so here you can see the r0 is the sensor resistance at 1000 r, r ppm of lbg in clean air and rs sensor resistance has varied basically what is the, the sensor contains what the basic kind of sensor is it's contain resistance so in air the resistance is more when you pass on the gas or we uh, put the sensor in gas environment the resistance become too less as compared to the like as shown in data sheet, data sheet so the curve basically changes accordingly and we get the values in form of voltage like here and this is that's why I have shown the voltage values you see gas sensor it is the time and you have the values of its maximum is a 5 if uh, more more than this value so what I, I will do use this I have purchased this from market sanitizer they have written it is that uh, it, it's contained uh, like uh, alcohol based so we'll be checking it okay so what I will be doing opening this uh, hand sanitizer and moving in front of this sensor pressing like just few droplets or gas we can see the changes now and monitor this one so you may see after some time it's some delay but the sensor takes time and it will show the output So here you can see the value has changed to 4. Why? Because this contains alcohol. As per the data sheet, it is properly responded. The value has changed dramatically from the earlier value of 0.83 volt to 3.96. Hence, proved that this sanitizer contains alcohol. So we will be testing this uh, another. Uh, type of uh, from another company uh, that whether it's contained alcohol or not so this is the famous Dettol hand sanitizer so we'll be using this also to prove it so once I have used the Dettol sanitizer its value just reached around 3.54 so hence proved that it is it's also contained alcohol so basically by comparing two products we can see that both are nearly of same value and hence proved that this is a or this uh, both sanitizer are authentic one so you can use it uh, in 
one watch in your hands properly.